76, the sky was red, thunder rumbling overhead. Bad King George couldn't sleep in his bed, and on that stormy morn, old Uncle Sam was born. Sam put on a three-cornered hat And in a Richmond church he sat And Patrick Henry told him that While America drew breath It was liberty or death What kind of hat is a three-cornered hat? Did they all believe in liberty in those days? Nobody who was anybody believed it. And everybody who was anybody, they doubted it. Nobody had faith. Nobody. Nobody but uh, Washington. Tom Paine, Benjamin Franklin, Chaim Solomon, Crispus Attucks, Lafayette. Nobody. Nobody's ran a tea party at Boston. Betsy Ross organized a sewing circle. Yeah, and Paul Revere had a horse race. And a little ragged group believed it. And some gentlemen and ladies believed it. And some wise men and some fools. And I believed it too. And you know who I am. No, who are you, mister? Yeah, how come all this? Well, I tell you, it's like this. No, let us tell you. Mr. Tom Jefferson, a mighty fine man, he rode it down in a mighty fine plan, and the rest all signed it with a mighty fine hand as they crossed their T's and dotted their eyes. Oh, brand new country did arise. Oh, oh, oh. And a mighty fine idea. Adopted unanimously in Congress July 4th, 1776. We hold these truths to be self evident that all men are created equal, that they are endowed by their creator. With certain inalienable rights That among these rights are life Yes, sir Liberty That's right And the pursuit of happiness Is that what they said? The very words That does sound mighty fine Building a nation is awful tough The people found the going rough and 13 states weren't large enough, so they started to expand into the western land. <laughs> Still, nobody who was anybody believed it. And everybody who was anybody, they stayed at home. But Lewis and Clark and the pioneers, driven by hunger, haunted by fears, the Klondike miners and the 49ers, some wanted freedom and some wanted riches, some liked to loaf while others dug ditches. They believed in it. And I believed it too. And you know who I am. Are you anyway, mister? Well, you see, it's like this. I started to tell you that uh, I represent... Oh, yes. That's it. Let my people go. That's the idea. Old Abe Lincoln was thin and long. His heart was high and his faith was strong. But he hated oppression, he hated wrong, and he went down to his grave to free the slave. And we 
here highly resolved that these dead shall not have died in vain. That government was the people, by the people and for the people shall not perish from the earth. Abraham Lincoln said that on November 19th, 1863 at Gettysburg, Pennsylvania. And he was right. I believe that, too. Say, we still don't know who you are, mister. Well, I started to tell you. There it is. The machine age came with an awful roar And America grew in peace and war And a million wheels went round and round Cities reached into the sky and dug down deep into the ground. And some got rich and some got poor. But the people carried through. Our country grew. Still nobody who was anybody believed it. And everybody who was anybody, they doubted it. And they are doubting still, and I guess they always will. But who cares what they say when I am on my way? Say, will you please tell us who you are? What's your name, buddy? Where are you going? Who are you? Well, I'm the everybody who's nobody. And I'm the nobody who's everybody. Yeah, well, what's your racket, friend? What do you do for a living? Well, I'm, uh, I'm an engineer, a musician, street cleaner, carpenter, teacher. How about a farmer? Also. Office clerk? Yes, ma'am. Mechanic? That's right. Housewife? Certainly. Factory worker? You said it. Stenographer? Yes, ma'am. Beauty specialist? Absolutely. Bartender? Absolutely. Truck driver? Definitely. Miner? Seamstress? Ditch digger? All of them are the et ceteras and the and so forth that do the work. Now, hold on here. What are you trying to give us? Are you an American? <laughs> Am I an American? I'm just a... Irish, Negro, Jewish, Italian, French, and English, Spanish, Russian, Chinese, Polish, Scotch, Hungarian, Litvox, Swedish, Finnish, Canadian, Greek, and Turk, and Czech, and double Czech American. And that ain't all. I was baptized Baptist, Methodist, Congregationalist, Lutheran, Atheist, Roman, Catholic, Orthodox, Jewish, Presbyterian, Seventh day Adventist, Mormon, Quaker, Christian Scientist, and lots more. You sure are something. Our country's strong, our country's young, and her greatest songs are still unsung. From her plains and mountains we have sprung to keep the faith with those who went before. We nobody's who are anybody, believe it. We anybody's who are everybody. Out of the cheating, out of the shouting, out of the murders and lynching, out of the windbags, the patriotic spouting, out of uncertainty and doubting, out of the carpet bag and the brass platoon, it will come again. Our marching song will come again. Simple as a hit tune, deep as our valleys, high as our mountains. Strong as the people who made it. For I have always believed it, and I believe it now. 